Right, should we give this a go then? Let's see what we've got here. So, in front of us here we have everything that we have gone out and collected to try and make a E36, E46, E80, whatever the fuck you want to call them. The rear bush removal kit and installation kit. Um, some of them is sockets, which are in the tray down there. Uh, some of them stuff have been to one of our local grab it from everything you got stores like screw fix, tool station, that sort of place. Um, ours is a particular choice for screw fix today. We've got some M12 BZP threaded bar. We have some M12 plate washers. We have these, which are the M12 stud connectors for doing your threaded bars. And Big old bag of these thick square plate washers, which are much, I don't know if you see those. He's very quiet, Tom, by the way, say hello. <laughs> hello. There you go, this is Tom, remember him? See the difference in those? So that's why we've got them, these are going to flex, we're going to put grease on those, we're going to use those as kind of bearing washers, and these are going to be our sort of weight bearing washers, as it were. So, what we did is out of my little bit of metal store. Found ourselves some tube, we got from Austin Natman many whiles ago. Cut a length of that off and welded one of these square plate washers to the end of it. Which took all of about five minutes. minutes. Say five minutes yeah. for the second messing around. Uh, we also cut a length of this off and welded one of those big ass studs on the end of it. These nut things on the end of it. So we ended up with effectively this. You have a look at this. You have the big ass plate washer on the end of here with the cup for the bush to go in. This has been rose welded on the end there. And then we've got a nice big load bearing nut for this. So we haven't tested this yet. In here we have various plates and uh, sockets which we're going to try and use to get these things out if none of this works or in, in conjunction with all of these and uh, we spent about what 28 29 pound on this stuff say 30 pound say 30 quid and we managed to get the thing on the day we went over to mill autos when we was over at Screwfix, and uh, and we priced up the actual tool to buy from them 185 pounds is the best price they could get for us so it's a bit of a joke to yeah be honest. you can get the tools for like 35 quid on online I think it is but it takes a couple of days to get here um, so doing it on the day, 30 quid call it, go to screw fix, you can get most of these parts if you've got a socket set or any bits of random tubing. Austin Knapman for us is five minutes away from screw fix, it was two minutes away from screw fix. So it's for us if you haven't got it already we can pop by there and grab that ourselves. So you may local metal stores and various places have the same sort of stuff. Um, that's 42.4 mil, 3 mil wall, um, just, just piping, just tubing, nothing special. Uh, I think we've got a 22mm and a 24mm socket down there which we're going to use to press bits and out. So we'll see which one works better. I think the 22mm is going to work a bit better. So, yeah, this is uh, the start of our bush release and press tool. And we'll let you know how it comes along. <laughs> That's a wrap. <laughs>